Hello my beautiful brothers and sisters in Christ. I hope that you're all doing well, that you're having a wonderful and a blessed day in the Lord. I want to share with you a dream that I had two nights ago from the Lord. He has been confirming this dream to me a lot and wanting me to share this with you. And he led me to paint the scenery for you also so that you could understand better what I saw exactly in the dream. Um, and I hope you enjoy. Lord, I pray that you will be here with me and you will speak through me and that you will minister to your people. Let your will be done. I plead the blood of Jesus over this video and over the listener. I pray that you will help me to remember this dream correctly and that this dream will encourage your people and lift them up and that you will use it for your glory and your purpose and you will co convict the listener to turn away from this world and from sin and to turn to you instead and I pray that everyone listening will be encouraged to get their oils filled and that I pray that they will all be accounted worthy to escape the things that are about to come and to stand before the Son of Man and that you will guide their staff and lead them with your Holy Spirit and that you will finish the good work in them and you will use them uh, for your glory to shine and they will, that they will have a boldness to share the gospel and to be a light in this world to remind them of who they are and how important they are to you and how much you love them. In Jesus' mighty name I pray. Amen. Yeah. So. I dreamt that I was in my apartment and I was looking outside my window and what I saw was this big uh, moon and it almost looked like a super moon or something. It was so big and very low in the sky and it was very detailed. It was almost like I could see every every detail of the moon um, and this big circle of light came around it um, and in the corner of this um, circle was this beam of rainbow light that almost looked like a crown and I was just watching this moon and and then this smaller moon that was much brighter than, than this moon came in the scenery and it was somewhere around here and it just went in this motion in front of the moon and just out of the scenery. Just this much smaller moon and brighter. Uh, what was below the moon was just simply um, uh, mountains and I, I you know my my eyes weren't focused on it my eyes were only focused on this moon and oh sorry and when I saw this moon I was I knew that that the rapture will be taking place the same night I just knew that in my spirit that the that the rapture was going to happen just later in the night. So I was showing people this moon in a dream and I was calling people to warn them to repent because the rapture is about to take place. And then I woke up from this dream. And and, and when I woke up I just I knew that this dream was from the Lord. I just knew it and and he confirmed confirmed it to me a few times and and I've been wondering you know about what this mean what this dream means and and he has been showing me you know 
you number 311 a lot and and the Lord has been leading me to Revelation 3 verse 11 and it says behold I come quickly hold that fast which thou hast that no man take thy crown um, so What you see here, this beam of light, you know, it 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 almost looks like a crown. And what he has been telling me is that it symbolizes a crown and a promise. And that this ring of of light um, is actually just a ring, and and that it is like symbolize Jesus proposing to his bride um, but I, I'm not sure about these moons you know if the rapture would take place during a full moon or if it means something else I can't tell um, if you have any idea and if the Lord tells you something then please contact me on my email it is in my description box or comment down below. Um, I've had a dream like that before about two moons and he has been showing me a lot of dreams about, you know, full moon, very big moon and a rapture. And he has showed me twice about this smaller moon. Um, I still don't know what it means, but uh, the Lord wanted me to share this dream with you for an encouragement and he wants to remind you that he's coming quickly and that you should hold fast which thou hast that no man take thy crown hold your crown hold to your promise he is coming and um, we do not know the day or the hour but we should keep watch each and every day be ready at all times and you know we can't be in the last minute to get our oils filled uh, you know get filled with the Holy Spirit we need to get filled with the Spirit right now um, you know time is up we need to get filled right now we need to be on fire right now we need to keep watch and and just hold to this promise that he is coming no matter how much you need to wait he is coming and I have a few verses that he wanted me to share with you also in, in Revelation 22 verse 7 it says behold I come quickly blessed is he that keepeth the saying of the prophecy of this book and in verse 12 it says and behold I come quickly and my reward is with me to give every man according as his work shall be I am Alpha and Omega the beginning and the end, the first and the last. And in verse 17 it says, And the Spirit and the bride say, Come. And let him that heareth say, Come. And let him that is a thirst come. And whosoever will, let him take the water of life freely. And, and the Lord also, <laughs> because I was, you know, I was kind of doubting about this dream. Uh, still, even though he confirmed this to me over and over again, uh, I had a dream this morning too, uh, and I was, you know, it was very, very vivid. <laughs> I was like, I was just in my room, and I was just floating up. I was just floating up into the sky, and yeah. So hold fast to this promise about the rapture. He is coming. Um, and and look off for redemption to us now and and I love you very much and I will be praying for you all that you will all be ready but just heed this warning and encouragement and and be blessed in the Lord thank you so much for watching bye bye